Hey everyone and welcome to your Airdrie Real Estate Market Update for September 2022. Now this month we saw a continuation of some of the trends that we've been seeing except for our pricing where we actually saw one style of home excel over the other three which we're going to get into a little later in the video. But first if you could hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already and we'll just get right into it. All right, well, let's pull up our Airdrie market graphic here. You're going to see that we had 169 sales in Airdrie in August, which is down from 184 in July, but still a historically high sales number. Now, to put that into perspective, 169 sales is still more than we had in any given month between 2015 and 2020, but we are continuing to see that downtrend in sales throughout the remainder of 2022. One thing I did notice around sales was in the last half of August, we had quite a few more sales than in the first half. Now there's not a whole lot of merit to that statement just yet, but we'll see if that trends into September at all, or if it was just a coincidence of the month. Now moving on to new listings, you'll see that we had 220 in August, which is almost exactly how many we saw in July. So that number didn't really move at all. So with sales down and new listings staying the same, that's brought our inventory up just slightly to 286 listings here in Airdrie, which gives us a month of supply of 1.69 months now. So we are getting closer and closer to that balanced market territory that we've been talking about for a few months now. And with an average sale price of 98.6%, of the list price right now, it really feels in the market like we're already there. And of course, you can see that we're now sitting at a year over year price change of 18.5%. Now this is our first time below 20% since January of this year. And with the price action that we saw earlier this year, you can expect that this will go closer to zero as the year goes on and likely it will dip into the negatives by about February next year, not because our prices are going to crash, but simply just because they went up so high so fast in the spring that it would be really unreasonable for us to hold on to that high year over year price increase like we're at now. All right, now let's get into pricing. We had one style that performed much better than the rest in August, so let's take a look. Our detached homes in Airdrie saw another one percent drop in the benchmark price I'd expect this to probably continue through the rest of 2022 those detached homes are now selling at about 98.5 percent of the list price so keep that in mind when you're going to list your home that they are selling a little bit further off that list price now now for those semi-detached homes it was a similar story with a price decrease of about 0.7 percent for the month and an average sale price of about 98 percent of the list price. As for condos, they saw their first price decrease in about a year, moving down about 1% in the last month. Our condos in Airdrie sold for an average of 97.5 of their list price last month. Which now brings us to our row homes or our town homes where we saw a price increase of about 1.5% in August, making townhomes the only style to increase their benchmark price in Airdrie last month. And with these, we saw an average sale price of 99.3% of the list price. All right, so now that you know that prices are still trending down slightly, except for the townhomes, which are still moving pretty strong, and it's happening at about the same pace each and every month, it seems. So what does this mean for you? Well, for you buyers, there's a fair chance that we're looking at more interest rate increases before the rates come back down. So knowing this, get a pre-approval in place if you plan to move in the next few months so you can get a rate locked in before they go up again. The price decreases that we're seeing are just not significant enough to make it worth it to wait for a lower price and pay a higher interest rate. If you're on the fence about buying and you'd be open to a conversation about your options, I'd be happy to have a conversation with you about what may be the best option for you. All of my information is down below and feel free to reach out anytime. Now for you sellers, with a multi-month trend now with prices going down about 1% per month, you need to be strategic with your pricing to make sure that you're getting a sale done and not chasing the market down. Now more than ever, it's important to hit the market right at market price because if you're too high and you sell in three or four months from now, you're likely gonna be leaving money on the table. As tempting as it is to test the waters with that higher price just to see if someone takes it, it very rarely works out. So make sure your house is presented competitively and attractive to potential buyers. And with an average days on market of 29 days now for all styles of homes and just over 30 days for those detached homes in Airdrie, you as a seller need to be prepared to keep your home in show ready condition for a longer time 
while you're listed as well. Well, we're into the final third of 2022 and we're still on pace to be reaching a balanced market during the fall of this year. If you're open to having a conversation about what this means for your specific situation, don't hesitate to call, text, or email me anytime. I'd be more than happy to chat. And as always, if you'd like to receive my monthly market report specifically for your neighborhood in Airdrie, that includes all the sales price information on there. There's a link in the description below to sign up for that. Or if you're curious what your home is worth in our current market, whether you plan to sell or not, there is a link in the description to receive a free home evaluation as well. That's all I have for you this month. My name is Brad Walker with Real Broker here in Airdrie. Please comment any additional thoughts that you might have about our current market or about any of the things that I mentioned in this video and we'll see you next month.